Hi tech enthusiasts, welcome to our channel Fast Cabling. So today, let's unleash the power of connectivity even in the toughest condition. Imagine a network setup that thrives in the face of extreme weather, dust, and challenging terrain. With the outdoor PoE switch, now you're not just connecting devices, you're conquering the great outdoor with robust and reliable network connectivity. So let's make your network as resilient as nature itself. And also, you can explore cutting-edge solutions on our website and discover a world of possibilities. So visit us now for the latest in technology innovation and take the next step toward a smarter and more connected future. Your tech journey begins here. So setting up an outdoor network comes with its unique set of challenges, especially in harsh environments where nature's element can be relentless. And from sudden surge to storms, rain, extreme temperatures, and dust, these conditions pose significant threat to traditional networking equipment. So understanding the need for establishing an outdoor network becomes imperative in this situation, as it allows for surveillance, communication, and connectivity in expansive outdoor spaces where traditional network may fail. A reliable network connectivity in harsh environment ensures seamless operation, timely data transmission, and uninterrupted access to critical information. In the face of these challenges, deploying specialized outdoor network equipment becomes a strategic necessity, offering robust solutions that withstand the records of nature, providing reliable connectivity and ensuring the continuity of essential services. So introducing our cutting-edge solution, the outdoor power over Ethernet switch that engineered to withstand the harshest environment, including surge, storm, rain, extreme temperatures, and dust. This outdoor PoE switch redefined the standard of network reliability. Unlike traditional networking equipment, outdoor PoE switch are fortified to resist nature's challenges, ensuring uninterrupted connectivity in the face of adversity. And you can place this device at outdoor environment without concern of water damage and to provide gigabit network speed and sufficient high power for multiple network devices with plug-and-play installation. This one here has eight 1000 megabit per second PoE port and two gigabit SFP port and also one gigabit RJ45 Ethernet port. And this can supply up to 10 kilometers fiber optical network between point A and point B. Since it has IP67 waterproof rating and aluminum IK10 fender proof rocket design, so you can place it in an outdoor environment. Also with a wide working temperature range from minus 30 degrees up to 60 degrees, which is ideal for harsh outdoor or industrial use. So without saying, Let's see what's the setup for today. So let's do the connection from the beginning. We have the router to provide internet access. This is the network video recorder and the monitor. And everything is already connected. Now I'm going to use a short patch cord to connect the router to our WebSmart PoE switch. So you can provide data to the fiber optic cable using the SFP slot and the SFP transceiver since this is where we connect with the fiber optic cable. Plug in a short fiber patch cord. This fiber patch cord is connected to our fiber optic termination box. As you can see, today we're using a full strength fiber optic cable. The, short patch, the fiber patch cord is already connected to it. Coming out, we have a 300 meters fiber optic cable and it is connected to another termination box. So you can see a very clean setup. The cables won't be messing around. And coming out, we are going to use this fiber patch cord to connect with our outdoor PoE switch. Here we have the SFP transceiver. Plug it into the SFP port. 
And here we are going to plug in the fiber patch cord. But first I want to show you we have a rubber seal. So it's completely waterproof. Make sure you stuck it in. And then fasten the gland tightly. You can also use a wrench to help you with it. And then I'm going to plug in the short patch cord to connect with a bullet camera. But also I want to show you the rubber seal for the ethernet cable. Let's plug it in, stuck it in properly. And then fasten it tightly. The power source is already connected. So now it has the power and the data that it needs connected with a bullet camera. Also, we can connect a wireless access point with it. Let's plug it in here. As you can see, all the indicated lights are on. So go back to the monitor, we can see a live video feed. I'm going to wave my hand so you can see this is a live video. And not only you can watch the video on the monitor, you can also do it on your phone. Let me open it up. And I'm going to wave my hand so you can see it too. So one consideration that we need to pay attention, which is the grounding. Now grounding is a fundamental concept in electrical system that ensures safety and proper functioning of the devices. Grounding provides a safe pathway for excess electrical current to flow into the ground. This is crucial to protect people and equipment from electrical shock or fires, which is particularly important in an outdoor setup. So grounding is like a safety net, redirecting excess energy to keep our electrical system secure and reliable. So we have to ground the switch. Since the power supply is built into the switch, that's why we already have a grounding cable all the way come to our outlets. But what about the other devices? Do we have to ground every device? Actually, devices operating under 60 volt are generally considered low voltage and their reduced voltage level contribute to a lower risk of electrical shock. So the answer, probably snow. Additionally, when a surge occurs, excess electrical energy seeks the path of least resistance to dissipate harmlessly into the ground. So in a properly grounded system, the grounding connection provides this low resistance pathway. And since the switch is already grounded, so the switch is likely to follow the grounding path through the switch and protecting both the switch and the connected low voltage device. And by using this outdoor PUE switch, not only you can simplify the setup by transmitting data and power to numerous devices, but also provide scalability and network expansion for future proving since you can add up to eight devices within 100 meters. So that's all for today. Thank you very much for joining us. If you like our video, please don't forget to like and subscribe our channel, Fast Cabling. And until next time, stay connected.